legendary rapper King Kaka showered his beloved mom with unconditional love on her big day. King Kaka's mother marked the 57th birthday on the 26th of April. Through his Instagram page, King Kaka flaunted the greatest woman in his life. The family man shared a photo posing next to his beautiful happy mom and penned a touching message and I quote, You are a blessing. He went ahead to acknowledge the sacrifices she has made through the years, expressing deep gratitude to his mom. Local prophetess Reverend Lucy Natasha recently confirmed she was a big fan of the jam Utawezana and had listened to it a couple of times. Speaking on Instagram live with comedian MC Jesse, the rich woman of God admitted indeed she knows Femi One and Major and that she has been their fan for a long time. Well, her revelation tickled Jesse, who never imagined Reverend would listen to such content, specifically such genre of music. Post Malone suddenly entertained with his Nirvana tribute performance, but the live stream show also raised serious funds for the coronavirus relief. If you missed it on Friday, Post sang and played a guitar al Kurt Cobian during a 15-song 80-minute set that included classics like About a Girl, Heart Shaped Box, and Calm As You Are. The makeshift tribute band raised $1 million in the first hour of the virtual concert alone, but that number since climbed to a whooping total of nearly $4.3 million and still counting. The Board brothers are joining a new family, that is the Rock Nation sports family, with Lamelo, Lonzo and Leangelo Ball all planning to sign with Jay-Z's new sports management company. Melo's business partner Jermaine Jackson went public with a decision on Monday saying the whole family is on board. Jackson said the family had been shopping for a new agency and spoke with several agents but ultimately, the family had good vibes with Rock Nation. Rock Nation will take the lead on marketing deals with the Ball brothers, including Lamelo's shoe deal. The media magnet behind the rival £350 million bid to buy Newcastle United wants to copy the model of Liverpool's American owners. Mirror Sports sources have revealed that Henry Maurice is a big fan of Liverpool's Boston owners John Henry and Tom Werner. Maurice was hugely impressed by the way Henry and Werner made Liverpool a force again after long periods of underachievement. He now wants to use similar model and business plan to reawaken slumbering giants Newcastle and make them Premier League title contenders.